guys want to know who I really am as Ethan Hawks? This is the new Ethan Hawks. Who the fuck are you? No. Nope. Let's go! Let's go! I didn't kick his ass! I've been waiting so long for this opportunity for this title match. And you want to know who I wanted to be all this time? I've said it before, I'll say it again. It's against Anthony Aries. He may look strong with this promo he did against me the other day, but you know what? I don't care because I'm going to take him down and I'm going to take him down hard. I am going to win this title and I am going to show everyone that I am worthy of this title. But that's not the only thing on my mind right now. Last night I was just minding my own business just trying to show off my identity. And this random ass person, he calls himself Felix Crow, attacks me out of nowhere like, who the fuck are you? Like, what are you doing in my area? I'm trying to show who that I am to everybody who I want to be. And he just has to attack me out of nowhere. But Felix Crow, if you want to be a real man, step in the ring with me and take off the mask because I want to know who you really are. defend my beautiful title against Ethan Hawk. Now, I accepted this match because, not because Ethan Hawk deserves a title match, because he obviously doesn't look at his track record in FBW, but because I need to humble Ethan Hawks. I need to cure Ethan Hawks from his delusional confidence that he has. 
Ethan Hawks has been going around at BW saying how he has his confidence and that he deserves a title shot and how he's gonna take the title off of me and reign FBW as FBW undisputed champ. And that just pisses me off. Now, I'm not a bad guy. I'm not a good guy. I'm just the guy. And I gotta do what I gotta do to stay FBW undisputed champ. Look, we just got this beautiful baby, and I'm not willing to give it up, certainly not to Ethan Hawks. You see, Ethan Hawks only has won, like what, like two matches here in FBW, and now he wants a shot at the title from the guy. Look, Ethan Hawks, I hope you're not telling your family or your new girlfriend that you're coming home with this title because you're not. Ethan Hawks, tonight I'm going to break your dreams. Your dreams of becoming champion are going to be broken because the pinnacle will not let you take my title. It is Ethan Hawks versus Anthony Aries for the new FBW Undisputed title. Now this match all came to be when Ethan Hawks challenged Anthony Aries last month at FBW Karma, stating that he has more confidence and he wants to take the gold off Anthony Aries. But here comes Ethan Hawks in his new mask, his new persona that he thinks will get him more success here in FBW. But Ethan Hawks, he has a tough challenge ahead. He has to face Anthony Aries, the seven-time world champion, the man who's done it all and beaten them all here in FBW to self-proclaim the pinnacle of FBW. Now, Anthony Aries last month defeated Chris Dynamite in the 30-minute Ironman match with up the score of 3-2-1 and merged both the Undisputed title and the King of the Earth title and has received, yes, we can confirm that he has received the brand new Undisputed title that he is about to come out with. But will Anthony Aries lose that brand new title tonight? Will he be champion forever and ever like he says? But here comes Anthony Aries with the brand new Undisputed title and coming out to that war of change by Thousand Foot Clutch instrumental a song that has defined his early part of his career but this match is for the undisputed title will anthony aries lose that title or will his reign continue on and also we see that anthony aries is rocking out an ankle brace anthony aries has injured his ankle doing other activities outside of wrestling now will that come into play will anthony aries lose this match because of that injury but both men locking up Ethan Hawks getting thrown into the gate. Anthony has his headlock in. Let's see how this ankle injury is going to play out in this match. I don't know if this is smart for Anthony Aries to compete, but he has been cleared by doctors to come out and wrestle Ethan Hawks. Now, both of these men has faced off two other times in FBW, and so far they are one to one. Anthony Aries defeating Ethan Hawks all the way back at AAW Retaliation and Ethan Hawks beating Anthony Aries at FBW Unbreakable this year. But Ethan Hawks barely beat Anthony Aries though, as you guys can watch back. Ethan Hawks barely got up. Ethan Hawks, he's fighting back right now, taking it to Anthony Aries with those punches to the chest. And a Hawks landing right off the bat. Ethan Hawks really trying to put it away. And Ethan Hawks, he's going after the leg. Ethan Hawks, however, not going for the cover. I don't know if that was smart. Who knows? He could have put Anthony Aries away. 
What is this? And he threw him right on top of that shed. And what is this? And he throws him into that wall. Ethan Hawks really taking it to Anthony Aries. We've never seen this side of Ethan Hawks. He's really taking it to Anthony Aries. In their other encounters, it was mostly Anthony Aries in control. But so far right now in this match, it is the other way around. And a Superman punch right to Ethan Hawks. And I don't know if that was smart, but he could have injured his ankle. But so far, no damage has been shown. And Ethan Hawks gets, gets thrown. Has him in a chokehold. Ethan Hawks with his brand new mask, his brand new identity. Now, oh, his mask fell off. Oh, look who it is. It's the jobber, Ethan Hawks. And Ethan Aries making fun of Ethan Hawks' win loss record here in FBW, calling him a jobber. What is this? And a punch taken down Anthony Aries. I'm gonna stomp right back to the lower back of Anthony Aries. Ethan Hawks really having a good showing in this match. We've never seen so much offense from Ethan Hawks before. And he ramps him right into the AC. More punches to the chest slash shoulder area. Ethan Hawks taking a breather, but it costed him right there. What is Anthony Aries? He's picking him up. And he throws him right on top. And Ethan Hawks is down. I don't know if he got all of that, but he's still got enough for him to go down and recover. Two. And Ethan Hawks kicks out. This match is for the brand new undisputed title. Will Anthony Aries walk away still with that title? Or Ethan Hawks win his first title or second title, my bad, here in FBW. And again, right into the gate. So far, that ankle injury hasn't been showing that it's really affecting Anthony Aries' his performance yet. But we'll see. Anthony Aries setting up that ladder right in the middle of the yard. And we are back here in one of the newer FBW arenas. However, it is no rain, no rules. Ethan Hawks trying to climb the ladder to get away from Anthony Aries, but Anthony Aries right up on Ethan Hawks. What's happening here? Anthony Aries now trying to climb the ladder with Ethan Hawks. And Ethan Hawks put his weight onto Anthony Aries. And the ladder almost clipped Anthony Aries right in the head. I don't know who got the worst of that. Both men are up. And a punch. Punches. Those punches, however, making Anthony Aries head ricochet off of the shed's wall. And he throws Anthony Aries right into the ladder. Anthony Aries is down. Punches for good measure. What is it? Ethan Hawks planning here. He's climbing the ladder. Ethan Hawks, he's going high risk. We never really see this. But Anthony Aries, he pushes off. He pushes him off the ladder. That's why it is called high risk. But Anthony Aries still trying to recover. And he gets pushed right back into the shed. Ethan Hawks really taking it to Anthony Aries. This is a different side of Cut. Ethan Hawks for One, sure. One, two. And Anthony Aries still kicks out. If Ethan Hawks wins the title here tonight, it would be his second title here in FBW. First being the King of the Yard title when he won it at FBW Unbreakable in an upset victory against Anthony Aries. But now Anthony Aries punching Ethan Hawks, punches, multiple punches to the head. What's happening here? Anthony Aries looking like he tried grabbing at the ankle. Starting to develop a small limp. Both men trading blows. And what is this? And a jumping clothesline right to the neck of Ethan Hawks. Look at that replay. 
what, the, what is Anthony Harris trying to do here? And he tried doing a big boot, but Ethan Hawks, he got out the way. And he gets thrown right up on top of that mini shed, and he gets pulled right back down. It looks like he landed on the ankle, the bad ankle. Can Ethan Hawks capitalize on that injury, or does Ethan Hawks have too much sympathy for Anthony Aries? Ethan Hawks, when he was in the Unwelcomed, he didn't really fit the bad guy role, which kind of played in part of Ethan Hawks getting out of the Unwelcomed. But will Ethan Hawks do whatever it takes? And a DDT to Ethan Hawks. One, two. And Ethan Hawks kicks out at two. Both men now getting back up. What is this? Looks like Anthony Aries has him in a lock of some shorts. Looks like he has him in an arm lock. You quit. And Ethan Hawks, he gets out. Both men trading blows. Oh, they are now near that pool. What are they trying to do? Anthony Aries, he's trying to get Ethan Hawks into the pool. He's, he's trying to get Ethan Hawks into the pool, trying to push him into that pool. Ethan Hawks, he gets out. Both men staggering. What is this? And another Hawks landing. But Ethan Hawks, he's down too. Can Ethan Hawks pin? This could be it. This is the second Hawks landing in this match. Ethan Hawks choosing not to cover. He's back up to his feet. I don't know what strategy Ethan Hawks has here. Maybe he knows that that second Ethan uh, Hawks landing probably would not have taken him out. Who knows? But whatever. Ethan Hawks is doing, he must have a game plan to defeat Anthony Aries. Anthony Aries back with some punches, but is this? And he pushes Ethan Hawks right into that ladder, taking the ladder down. Anthony Aries now with that chair. Strikes to the midsection. Now we all know Ethan Hawks, his cardio is not that great, as we saw it at FPW Unbreakable. When Ethan Hawks won, he barely got up after the match. So Anthony is going after the midsection and the neck of Ethan Hawks is a really good strategy. That is why Anthony Aries is a seven-time world champ. Ethan Hawks blocking his punches. Both men trading blows a lot in this match. And Anthony Aries has him in another headlock. What is this? Tried went going for the third Hawks landing, but, he, but Anthony Aries did not let it happen. Quit? Now he has him in an arm lock and punches to the side. Do you quit? Anthony Aries really knows how to hurt his opponents, quit? and now he has him in a headlock, not giving Ethan Hawks any recovery time. What is Anthony Aries going for here? Is, is he going for? What is he going for? He just took off. What is this? Oh, and a face plant to Ethan Hawks. A face plant drove him right into the ground. What is Anthony Aries going for here? He ripped off the mask of Ethan Hawks, exposing the man in a forearm. In a forearm right to Ethan Hawks. What is this? He's trying to get him into a submission of some sort. And plunges right to the side of the head. Ethan Hawks looks down and out. Is the hope dying in Ethan Hawks? What is Anthony Aries doing here? Anthony is taking a break. Could his ankle be affecting him? And Ethan Hawks with punches. Punches right. What is this? What is this? And he threw him right into the chain linked fence. Now Ethan Hawks has that chair. Right to the chest. Right to the chest and to the injured knee. What is this? He now has that rope. 
He has a piece of rope. What is what is he doing here? And he's whipping. He just whipped Anthony Aries. And he whips him again. And again. He just whipped. Now Anthony Aries. What is this? What is Anthony Aries trying to do? He's spinning Ethan Hawks. And a jumping clothesline. A jumping clothesline to Ethan Hawks. He spinned him, got him all dizzy, and he took him down. What is this? He is going for, what is he going for? The Curse of Aries. He has the Curse of Aries locked in. Is Ethan Hawks going to tap? And Ethan Hawks taps out. Anthony Aries. And Anthony Aries retains a good fight for Ethan Hawks, but not good enough to take down the pinnacle Anthony Aries. What a show. I don't think Ethan Hawks has ever took it to anybody like he did to anyone in FBW. But look at this. Anthony Aries is showing respect to Ethan Hawks. Even though I lost, I learned my lesson. I'm not going down hard. I went down hard last time, I doubted myself. But this time, I had confidence and I feel like I did pretty well against a seven time FBW champion. I'm only going to get better and better and better. So Anthony Aries, you put on a good match, but it's only going to get harder from here on out because Ethan Hawks is still at the beginning, but I can't say that anymore. I'm at the next level, but I am not at your level. So every time you see me in the future, I'm only going to get better from here on out. So, <clears throat> I retained my title against Ethan Hawks. Shouldn't be a shocker, shouldn't be a surprise. But Ethan Hawks did give a fight. I gotta admit, he has improved. But he's still not on my level. Ethan Hawks, I wouldn't say you came close to winning this bad boy. But you did show a good showing in that match. You know, maybe one day, if you keep doing what you're doing, you will deserve a shot at this. Look, I said I was going to go in there and humble Ethan Hawks, and I did. I retained my title. So now hopefully no delusional wrestlers like Ethan Hawks come my way. Look, I don't care who challenges me for this title at the next FBW event. I don't care who it is. There's some new competition in FBW and Felix Crow. He took out Ethan Hawks the other night. Look, Felix Crow, I've been watching your Instagram. Don't get in my way. I don't care how creepy you are, how strange you are, how dark you are, because I've defeated people like you, like the demon of Chris Dynamite. Look, I'm going to say it again. I'm going to remain FBW champion for a very long time time and to all those people who think I'm a paper champion because of my 2020 track record no because I've proved it every time I stepped in the ring since winning this title I'm the best and I'm going to be champion for a very long time